You sound like a dying pig. Um, yeah, you know what? What? I'm gonna say something. Okay, I'm ready for you to say something. I'm gonna say hello and welcome to Roasty Toasty Ghosty. This is Matthias speaking, and I'm looking at a person who goes by the name Lauren... That's me. Hello, and welcome to me. So, you want me to leave now? No, because you were my guest. (laughs) Okay, okay, yeah. We're here today with our special guest, Matthias. Hello. Hello. How are you? I'm good. Good. How are you? I'm good. I am so thrilled to see you Mm -hmm. here today. That's good. Yeah, you're welcome. (laughs) Thank you. That's good. (laughs) Yeah, well, we couldn't find anyone better to be here, so no. you're you're just the only. I'll do. Yeah, you're you're good enough for now. Yeah. Okay. So you're good. Yeah, I'm good. That's awesome. You're good. Mm. How was your day? It, it was busy. Okay. Yeah, I mean, the day went kind of fast. My work day didn't start off so great. No, I was just gonna ask you something. Mm-hmm. How was your day? My work day didn't start off that great. Oh, okay. That great. Oh, so, okay. So, um, that happened. And, but the second half was better. Yeah, it did get better. Yeah, I like Fridays that way. Because after lunch, you only have three hours. Yeah. Well, I prefer my entire day to be great. But the f- first half wasn't great. But then the second half got better. Yeah. I was kind of sent all over the place today. Yeah. I didn't like it. But I'm good now. Um, What have we been up to this week? Yeah, that's a good question. Not much. We started off with Mad Libs on Saturday. Our dirty, drunk Mad Libs. Yeah. Which was actually kind of fun. Yeah. I enjoyed it. Yeah, it was fun. I have some orange juice sips. Yeah. With vodka. We well, got drunk. We, yeah, we probably won't do the dirty Mad Libs again, though. Mm, probably not, but no, I... No, it was fun, but... It was. It, the, I think we should have it like a one-time mm-hmm. thing. That makes it more special. If it gets a strong demand, then maybe we'll do it again. Maybe. Next year. Yeah, can be a This year yearly, is booked. Yeah, a yearly thing. Mm-hmm. Yeah. If people want that. Yeah. Otherwise, we'll skip it. Sounds good. Yeah. But it was fun, and I slapped you. Yeah. Ow, my eye. <laughs> Are you okay? On the other side. Yeah, it was kind of funny. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I was just trying to wake you up, and yeah. it was definitely not intentional to hit you so hard. <laughs> well, I was going for hard, but not, like, that hard. <laughs> you did say I am strong. You had it coming. Yeah. And now your neck is broken. Yeah. <laughs> My neck is broken. <laughs> Again. <sighs> last year was the same. No, last year was much, much worse. This year is fine. So far. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Did you have anything else to say about the Mad Libs? No. It was good. Yeah. And Sunday. Oh, I don't think I did too much on Sunday. I did some cleaning and... Editing. Editing. And some food shopping. But that was pretty much it. Yeah, I did. I was was having a a low day, so I was chilling most of the time. I was moving big, heavy stuff from the apartment. But now that's done so now now it feels great awesome that's sunday mm. also i had pizza oh awesome. nice yeah was that it <laughs> what no was was that it <laughs> just pizza <laughs> just pizza you didn't get like anything else <laughs> Okay. No, I didn't. I'm sorry. Yeah. That's extremely unfortunate yeah, for you. Yeah, I was starving. Mm-hmm. I just got a pizza. <laughs> just it. one pizza. Like, that's, that's it? Yeah. What are you trying to do to me, Mom? Starve me? <laughs> Monday, we went to work? Yeah, I think it was a good day. I mean, nothing really happened this week. No. Can I just shorten it and say that, you yeah. know, we've had a pretty chill week. Yeah. No drama. No drama. We tried. Yeah. Jokingly. Assumingly. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, it's been pretty good. Nothing really happened. No No. events. We went to the gym on Wednesday. We biked, and that was fun. Yesterday, it rained. 
Well, it's it's been raining like all week, but I ran outside with the kids. Yeah. And we played in the rain. And the rain is so welcome. It's so nice. Yeah, I hope it stays. Yeah. <laughs> Otherwise, I have to bike to work next <laughs> week. I hope you don't, for your sake. Yeah. And uh, then we went inside and we had some cake mm -hmm. because it was my life partner's birthday on Wednesday. The fifth. Yeah. Happy birthday, partner. <laughs> Happy birthday, partner. So we ate cake and then I caught it up with the kids in my daughter's room and we watched Avatar for a bit. You it was fell nice. asleep? I fell asleep on the floor. That's where I was. Yeah. It was it's nice, a, though. Yeah, it's a long movie. I definitely did not watch the whole thing. I no. left the room before, I, like, even half of it. <laughs> yeah. I told them I don't want to watch a long movie. They were like, we'll just turn it off when we get too tired. Hmm. Like, all right. <laughs> Bye. It's a, it's a good movie, though. I yeah. Like. They were really excited to see it. Too um, bad we have to wait almost two years until mm -hmm. the next one. Yeah. But today yeah. is July 7th, 2023. Today is Friday. Would you like a movie on? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> oh, well. No happy feelings today. It's no. Friday. It's Angry Friday. What did we watch? We watched Magnificent Bodyguards and uh, Nowhere Boy. So there. Wow. Okay, so we watched Magnificent Seven. Body. Body. Gu guards. Guards. Where did Seven come from? Uh, that's another movie. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Completely irrelevant. Yeah. Isn't that superheroes? <clears throat> no, oh. it's a Western. Okay. There's one from the 60s, and there's a remake. Um, in 2015. That's a lot. That's a lot. That's too much. Doesn't um, the second one make it 14? What? <laughs> uh huh. Oh, yeah. Okay. Uh huh. Uh -huh I get it now. I'm like, no, 2015. <laughs> <laughs> 14. <laughs> And also, the first one from the 60s got like three sequels. Uh. Yeah. And just a little side note. The first one is actually a remake from the Japanese movie uh, Seven Samurai. Huh? So they are Kurosawa. superheroes. No, cowboys in the... The samurais are cowboys. No, the samurais are samurais. Mm -hmm. Then in the remake, they are cowboys. Why? Uh, because the um, Americans wanted to take the Japanese concept and make it their own. Okay. And what's more American than a cowboy? It's a good question. I'll have to think about that. Yeah. Native Americans? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, they are the true American. No. No, no, they're not. They weren't there first. Anything like that. Maybe they were. Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I'm I'm just a sweet. What do you I know? I don't know. I don't know. You don't know. I don't anything. know. I, I, you I wasn't know there. Nothing. I, I, I was I, I wasn't there. So uh, I don't know. I I've never been there. Me neither. Yes, you have. Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I think you have been to the states. I haven't been to the Native Americans. Oh, okay. Uh, magnificent bodies. Almost. Okay. Um, magnificent bodyguards. Bodyguards. Magnificent bodyguards with Jackie Chan. Yes. Where do I start with this movie? I don't know. I'm not even sure if I can give you a summary. No. Honestly, it's another one of those when I just, I, I don't know what was going on. No. I'm sure it's a very good story. <laughs> I did watch the whole movie. Uh, I don't know what was going on. Okay. It was partially Star Wars. Yeah, it had Star Wars music in it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It was from 78, you said? Yeah. So, that explains that. that well, explains uh, a lot. nothing really explains why they had to reuse the music from Star Wars. It, it was popular. Everyone wanted Star Wars music. Yeah. I'm just wondering, did they have the rights for that? Must have. Yeah. Otherwise, I don't think it would be released with the music. No. Someone must have said okay to this. Yeah. They made funny noises. Yeah. What else? <laughs> there was a deaf guy. There was a deaf guy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It was kind of short. No, I think they are supposed to carrying the thing with the thing in. Mm -hmm. You know. It's like what? a carriage that yeah. the people carry. Yeah. A carriage. Yeah, I guess. 
I, I don't know the, the technical term. <laughs> there was a person in there, and which you didn't see until the end of the movie, and it was a twist, and uh, it, there was supposed to go, what was it, the stormy... Mountains? Yeah, stormy mountains uh, go through that. And that's why they needed the bodyguards, since it was a, such a dangerous path to go. And there were killers and... Bandits. Bandits. Yes, rock-throwing bandits. They reused a lot of the shots there. Yeah. Did you notice that a lot of things were thrown at the camera? Yeah. There were a lot of camera shots, like, right up into yeah. the camera. Yeah, they were punching the camera. Mm-hmm. They were throwing rocks at the camera. They were throwing... Snakes in the camera. Yeah, snakes, uh, sticks... Mm-hmm. Or yeah, and all that was because that this movie was shot in 3D. I think it's the only Jackie Chan movie shot in 3D. Okay. So it was to get the effect right. that something was coming right towards you. Mm. Yeah. And um, I didn't see it in 3D. No, we didn't. Uh, no. no. Yeah, I did. Uh, I just did, but uh, just I have. Now. I, yeah, I have specialized. So I. Oh. <laughs> no. Suddenly, you're better than everyone else. <laughs> yes. Okay. No, I don't. I don't think it's um, released in 3D um, on Blu-ray or DVD. Okay. So I guess that was just for the theatrical release in Asia mm-hmm. in the 70s. Yeah. I guess it wasn't a big success back then. No, probably I, not. Yeah, and I kind of get it. It's, yeah. It's not the best movie. I wouldn't say it's his worst, uh, but it's one of the worst. It's not the worst. Okay. You think it's the worst? No. No. Uh, I, don't, I don't know. I don't know. No, okay. But it is down there. Yeah. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, it it has a weird ending too. Mm. It kind of it just felt, ends. Yeah, in, very sudden. Yeah, just in the middle of a scene, they just cut to yep. the end. The end. <laughs> yeah, freeze frame, and then just the end. Yeah, it was it, kind of a strange movie. Yeah, but I want us to see all the Jackie Chan movies, so that's why I added this to the list. I also want to see all of the movies. Yeah. Should we talk about Nowhere Boy? All right. We can do that. Go ahead. Um, yeah, it's a movie about uh, uh, young Lennon. <laughs> young John Lennon. Mm-hmm. And uh, it's um, about his life uh, with his uh, mom and aunt. And we see his start with the music and learning to play banjo and uh, guitar and he meets uh, Paul McCartney and uh, George Harrison and yeah we get to see how uh, what his inspirations were sorry I I was thinking of something else while you were talking yeah that thank you for not listening to me (laughs) was not intentional Uh, no no I was just thinking uh, because you said that John had met Paul and George, and why not Ringo? Um, That's because Ringo came later into the group. Mm. He wasn't there from the beginning. Yeah, they hadn't even started the Beatles yet um, no. before the movie had ended. Exactly. And there was not even mention of Beatles. No. But I'm pretty sure I read somewhere that there was a different drummer in the very beginning. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know his name, but I, I know I read about it too. Yeah. He quit or got kicked out. Yeah. And got replaced by Ringo. Yeah. And that might be why Ringo wasn't in the movie. Yeah. I don't remember what the guy's name was, though. No. What? what? Um, yeah. What, what did I think about the movie? That's exactly what I was going to yeah, say. You said, I said what? 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 <laughs> <laughs> okay. Will you talk already? <laughs> what? What? Okay. Uh, I thought it was interesting uh, to see all that and uh, get to know more of the background. Mm. Then I it, it kind of like the other movie. I thought it ended too soon. You know, I wanted to see more. Yeah. It felt like uh, <laughs> they were like, eh, that's enough. Let's. 
it's ended here. Yeah, that was weird. Uh, but no, I liked it. It, it was good. Yeah, mm, what did you think about it? I enjoyed it too. I read up on it a little bit before we watched it. Okay. And like any of the other biopics, it's not like 100% true. Mm. Not everything actually happened. No, I read about that too. Yeah, it's just a movie. Yeah, like... Uh, uh, John never actually punched Paul. No, exactly. And John never actually rode on top of a bus. No. <laughs> it was silly. Uh, yeah, that that was... Uh, why did they... <laughs> uh, I don't know. And no. How did they get away with that? Yeah. Whatever. <laughs> it's a movie. Yeah. But it was good. Yeah. The guy who played um, John Lennon... In this movie, Aaron Johnson. He has worked with Jack and Chan before. Mm-hmm. When he was a little kid. Okay. In the movie Shanghai Nights. Mm-hmm. Just a side note. Yeah. This was a movie that we added, what, last week? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Just last week. I, I, I knew about it before. I did not. No, okay. I had no clue. And I was pretty excited about this, so... Mm. I stuck it in for this week. Yeah, and it's uh, kind of um, interesting that um, the director to this movie and the and the guy who played John Lennon that they met and that and the director she is like twenty three years older than him, <laughs> <laughs> and they got married and all and still together. I think. Yeah. Kind of cool. Yeah, and at some point we're gonna watch Get Back. Yeah, the but it's not going to be, yeah, it's not going to be on the list. Though. No, it's That's, not on the list. That's going to be a side thing. Yeah. Like TV shows and stuff or yeah. series yeah. and stuff. Anything else to add? I don't think so. Do you have anything? It was a bit dramatic, the movie. Yeah. What did you think about the portrayal of the guys? Yeah, I thought it was pretty good. Um, I didn't really uh see George. In the actor? No, I I don't. Yeah, I I don't know. I didn't either. I I f- I felt like other actors could have played. You know. Uh, and like usually they'll cast uh, actors who generally look yeah somewhat yeah similar. I, I feel that they didn't care about that. No, in, in but I movie. also find that I have a hard time pointing out George anyway. Yeah. <laughs> Okay. I, his his face isn't exactly burned into my memory. No. So, like I said, like all the others. <laughs> yeah, like like I said a few weeks ago, he's just there. Yeah, it's just <laughs> kind of there. Yeah, I guess so. The other one, the other ones have their personality. is yeah. just there. <laughs> yeah. No. He's still good. He's yeah. a very important part yeah. of the Beatles. Of course. And uh, that's all I really have to say. Yeah. Um, but I did like the movie. Hmm? It was a bit dramatic, a little emotional. Uh, yeah, but it was yeah, good. Yeah, there were scenes, uh, scenes that I didn't so- see coming. Mm-hmm. It feels like it's kind of rare for movies to like surprise you yeah surprise yeah. me like that a lot of movies you kinda you can predictable yeah you kind of can see what's uh, gonna happen um, yeah i mean if you kind of know generally how movies are written and like there's certain characters that will do a certain thing then you know what's gonna happen to them later yeah or just like by their general personality or mm. how they look or whatever. Yeah. Usually you can predict these things. Yeah. No, but well, it had yeah. surprising scenes. So I I liked it. It was good. It was. What else? What else? What else? Is it time for a break or something? Is there something else you want to talk about? Right now? Yeah, right now. <sighs> What's the first thing that comes to your head? What are we talking about? Uh, we were talking about movies. Uh huh. But I think we're done with that right. now. Do you want to finish this? Sure. All right. Okay. Matthias finished my sips. Yeah. He said blah. Maybe we should take a break now. My lip reading has gotten worse, hasn't it? Yeah. Do I lip read you while you're actually talking to me? Um, I noticed that you <laughs> were doing that at work. 
I I mouth your words yeah. while you're talking. Yeah, and you don't know what I I'm going to say, but... You, for some... I, what is my mouth even doing? Yeah. Is it, like, trying to predict what you're trying to say? Yeah, I think so. You know yeah. when you're watching, like, live TV and you have the subtitles on? Yeah. And it, like, tries to keep up? <sighs> And yeah. then, like, sometimes it'll go back and, like, correct itself. I think that's what I'm doing. Oh, okay. So you're correcting me? Well, no. I'm, like, kind of uh, guessing you're what you're going to uh, say, yeah. and then I go back, and then uh, I actually yeah, say you're what you're try- trying to say. Yeah, you're trying to, like, subtitle me? Yeah. <laughs> I'm reading the subtitles yeah. that are not actually there, but I I don't uh, know. Yeah. I, may- may- I can't actually see it in front of you, but like in my head, it's yeah. kind of like scrolling. Do you uh, move your lips when you read? I must. Yeah. I probably do. I definitely do when I'm listening to music. Uh, I know that I'm mouthing along yeah, to okay. the yeah. songs. Yeah, but you know lyrics to all of the songs in the whole wide world. So <laughs> Not exactly, <laughs> but uh, a lot. Yeah, like 90% of them. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know about that. But um, when I'm reading, I wouldn't be surprised. No, I never catch myself. No, it's so I don't know. Uh, yeah, I mean, it's just it's something difficult that to see yourself reading. Yeah, you know? and I don't really feel it either. No, I don't know. It's just something that if you would, automatically happens. Yeah, if you would um, film yourself while reading, you you would probably <laughs> see if you do it or not. Do you want I've, to try it? No, and, I've so. already seen it happen. Yeah, but, I'm reading and mouthing along to your y- words. Yeah, to my yeah, but that was just to help me. I, I assumed to help you with my lips. <laughs> no, to help me read the words. Oh, I don't I guess. know. I don't know. I don't know why. That, I do that's it. what I kind of assumed that you thought. Hey, this guy, he doesn't know what... <laughs> he doesn't know how to read. No. <laughs> Let me read with my lips, and yeah. that'll help. Yeah. <laughs> You're welcome. Yeah. I'm so helpful. Yeah. I'm helping Matthias. Yay! <laughs> okay. I'm what weird. about now? What about now? Break. Yes. Let's do that. Let's take would a break. You, would you like to take a break? Yeah. Or would you like to spend like five minutes thinking about taking a break? No. And then possibly take a break? Uh, I think we should take a break right now. You're in a rush. Yeah. All right. We'll take a break then. Let's take a break. We'll be right back. Goodbye. Are we here? Are we back? We are back. Right now, we are back. We are. Yeah, mm-hmm. back we are. We're back. We're back. We're back where we belong. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We're back. Yeah. Yeah, it, it, it kind of works. Yeah. yeah. All right. We I have, have been on full Beatles mode yeah, all week. we have been <laughs> listening to a lot of Beatles songs. Mm-hmm. I've pretty much only been listening to the Beatles all week. Yeah. Beatles all they week. They are really good. Yeah. I'm enjoying it. Yeah. It's not old yet. No. Not for me. I don't think it's it, not they'll new. ever get old. It's not new, but... <laughs> N- no, it's not exactly new, but it's not like... No. You... It's gotten to the point where... I can't stand it anymore. No, exactly. All right, Matthias. What's going on? What are we doing today? I don't know. Nothing. 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 Are we going to talk about something? Yeah, probably. We have always something to talk about. Yeah. Did you add the movie about the McDonald's? No, I don't think so. Oh, no. I'm, 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 no. Oh, no. I'm, I'm going to add it to the Michael Keaton movies. Okay. So when you get to this part of editing, are you going to add it to the list? Mm, yeah. Okay, so Matthias, stop what you're doing and add the movie to the list, please. I think I got it. And now we will continue. Yeah, thank you. Thank you, Matthias. My future self. Do you have any advice for your future self? Don't do drugs unless it's like... Necessary. (laughs) Yeah, unless it's... Don't do drugs if it's dangerous drugs. Okay. Don't do dangerous drugs. Yeah. You're giving yourself a little loophole there. Yeah. Mm-hmm. That's good advice for you. You hear that? Are you listening, oh, yeah. Matthias? Oh, yeah. I, 
I guess we'll have to wait for the answer. I guess. Yeah. At some point. Yeah. Um, do you want another history lesson? All right. No, I was thinking since we just watched a movie about most of the Beatles, mm-hmm. I would like to know more about the history of Ringo Starr. I don't know how he grew up. You do know. You're the uh-huh. one who knows. Uh huh. No one else knows. Mm-hmm. You're the okay. one with the facts. Do you want him to be poor or? <laughs> <laughs> Once upon a time, in like the 30s, yeah, 40s maybe, yeah, someone was born. He was born with the name uh, Rocco. <laughs> <laughs> right? Yeah. I think I think that was his name. But as he grew up, he had this collection of rings. Okay. Uh, so he was like, I don't want my name to be Rocco anymore. My name is now Ringo. Oh. Okay. Yeah. And I'm going to be a star. So, you know, Ringo Star, that's his name. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he had already decided. <laughs> Okay. That was his name. <laughs> At like five years old. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So, I'm gonna be a star. He's the rock at heart. Yeah, okay. He, he's a rock heart. <laughs> he is. That's where his name originated. Mm-hmm. Okay. And he really liked to drum on things. Brrr, like that. Yeah, okay. Mm-hmm. Like what? Pots and pans. Ah. Originally... And then, like, pretty much anything, Mm -hmm. he would go out into the woods with some sticks. Go on, like, rocks and stuff. I'm assuming he's a woodland person (laughs) from London. Yeah, that sounds about right. Is there forest in London? Isn't it a forest? I know nothing. Some people call it a city. I would call it a forest. Building forest? (laughs) Yeah. (laughs) A forest with buildings. Yeah. Maybe. So, Three yeah. houses. Yeah. You could say that. So, he liked to drum. Yeah. And he went to school to be a construction worker, I think. Mm-hmm. Because he's the rock, so he likes to move rocks. Oh, uh-huh. yeah. Makes sense. With yeah. a, you know, hard hat and... Uh, yeah. Everything. Yeah. A rock hard hat. Yeah. <laughs> it's a hat. <laughs> Please continue. I'm trying to. Yeah, what did you say? He wanted to be a construction worker? Well, he he, uh, went to school to be a construction worker. Yeah. Because he liked the idea of moving rocks, but he did some soul searching. Oh. And he discovered that moving rocks wasn't what he was supposed to be doing. He was supposed to be a rock star. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, with his rings. Mm, yeah. Mm-hmm. You can even see one of the rings in the movie Help. That's they are right. trying to take it off his finger, yeah. but no. It wouldn't come off? No. No. So he wanted to be a rock star. Yeah. Instead. So he got himself an actual drum set, and he played drums. Okay. Boom, 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 boom. That's what he did. Boom, boom. Bum, bum. Was it expensive? The Was it? Um, I don't know. Like a beginner's drum set, maybe? Okay. Mm-hmm. And, uh, you know, just in case it didn't work out for him. You don't mm. want to spend too much money on that. True. Did he have a lot of money or was it? I don't know. Average? Average. Yeah. Right in the middle there. And then he met Paul McCartney. Oh, okay. You know, I once had a physical therapist when I was, uh, Younger, when I was a kid and cheerleading, I think I had hurt my ankle or something. Yeah. And I had a physical therapist, and his name was Paul. And I would Not go in McCartney. there, and I would call him Paul McCartney. Okay. But his name wasn't McCartney. No. No. His name was. was Paul, but I kept calling him Paul McCartney. Oh. <laughs> He's like, I'm not Paul McCartney, I'm Paul Simon. Yeah. No. (laughs) Yeah, I don't know. (laughs) Paul McCartney was a physical therapist at the time. Okay. (laughs) Did uh, Ringo need uh, physical therapy? For his wrists. Oh, yeah, okay. Hmm? Because he was drumming so hard, he hurt himself. Okay. Calm down over there. Yeah, that's what Paul McCartney said. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah. (laughs) 
You're drumming too hard. You need to calm down. <laughs> so Paul helped with Ringo's wrists. And Ringo was like, we should start a band. <laughs> <laughs> I have drums that I want to drum, but I have no band. Oh, yeah. And Paul was like, you should join my band instead. Like, You're not going to start a band. You can just join mine. Yeah. Ringo was like, okay. So they did that. Yeah. And they were called the Beat Alls. Ah. Mm -hmm. The Beat Ops? Beat Alls. Oh. So they, they formed the Beatles, or the Beatles were completed. Yeah, you got to finish in the Beatles. Yeah, mm. that's right. You finished the Beatles. You <laughs> finished the Beatles. <laughs> it's like, you know what? I'm in this band now, and you all are done here. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm going to finish you all. <laughs> I'm the only Beatle left. <laughs> Paul was like, but I'm still alive. And Ringo was like, you're not a part of this anymore. <laughs> not for I'm long. the Beatles. <laughs> yeah. So Ringo took over. Oh, yeah. And he took over the Beatles, and then he took over the world. Yeah, okay. And he is... Uh, He's the leader of the world? He now? is the leader of the world. He's oh. the master of everything. Hmm. And he's just... He's got so much power. <laughs> yeah. He's really funny, too. <laughs> yeah, he, he is. Yeah. And that's the end of my story. Do you have any questions? No. You covered... At all. Mm -hmm. I decided that I'm going to make a musical made up of the Beatles songs. Ooh, that would be so cool. <laughs> yeah, it's going to be kind of like Hamilton, yeah. as in like it's only the songs without okay. the dialogue. Okay, so. And kind of like Mamma Mia. Yeah. With like with ABBA, the, in, yeah. but it's Beatles instead of ABBA. Yeah. Yeah. I think that would be really fun, but extremely expensive. Yeah. Would you like to make, like, musicals for all the bands? No, but, I mean, the Beatles songs are written as, like, communication in a way. Yeah. So it would be fun to make, like, dialogue mm -hmm. out of the songs. Yeah. You know, or, like, conversations. But they're all really just, like, love songs. So there would be a lot of love talk. Yeah. It's like all about love. Yeah. That's the entire movie. <laughs> It's love and broken hearts and more love. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So yeah, that's what I'm going to do for the rest of my life. I'll think about it, but I won't actually do it. No, you should write the script. I'll write it and keep it to myself. Yeah, I, w I would like to read it. <laughs> okay. Which beetle are you going to play? <sighs> Or wait, no, I'm going to ask which one I should play. <laughs> yeah, okay. Which one would you like to play? Well, I'm asking which one I should play. Yeah. yeah. Okay, you're asking me. Yeah. Oh. If I was to be a beetle, which one would I be? I mean, you are funny, so I would not probably say Ringo. I think he's okay. f the funniest. I could wear a yellow dress. Yeah. Or a yellow submarine. Do you think I would look good in yellow? <laughs> would you be the su submarine? I'm, yes, I played the part of the submarine. <laughs> I'm sorry for laughing. You wanna hear a secret? <laughs> <laughs> I yeah. like that song. It's been stuck in my head. Yeah, yeah, I had um, different Beatles songs in my head too. Today, it was Oh Bloody. Mm -hmm. That one. Oh, bloody, oh, blana, life goes on. Na, 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 goes on. Yeah, I had other songs too. I can't remember them right now, but yeah, they have made a lot of good songs. So many. Yeah, and you know, um, I didn't know them as well when I was younger, mm -hmm. but songs that you have heard, like, I don't even know where um, and I didn't even know it was them yeah like twist and shout I didn't know mm. it was them yeah um, and uh, yeah other songs too I'm like is that Beatles too <laughs> <laughs> and very varied it's not just the one genre it's right. uh, it's a lot of genres yeah you know like rock and uh, yeah rock and know. pop Yeah, really. rock and pop and uh, ballads and so many ballads. Yeah, it's good. 
Yeah, very it's good. It's all good. Yeah, I like them. Do you think we can do the other thing too? Well, what if we cut it down to five steps? Okay. Five things. Okay. Okay? We will do an open eyes part two. Yeah. So, last week, we learned how to take a compliment. Yeah. Do you remember how to take a compliment? Yeah. Okay. But I'm not going to tell you right now because it took way too long. All right. I can listen to last week. You can week. listen to last week's. That's fine. Yeah. This week, I would like to teach you how to give a compliment. Mm-hmm. In five steps. In five steps. Because you don't give compliments that much. No. <laughs> After today, I expect more compliments. Yeah, you're going to be disappointed. All right. We'll see about that. I only want to hear nice things. Okay. Chat thing. Open AI. How to give a compliment in five simple steps. Giving a compliment is a great way to make someone feel good and appreciated. Here are five simple steps to follow when giving a compliment. Mm -hmm. All right? Yeah. One, be genuine. Ensure that your compliment is sincere and comes from the heart. Authenticity is key in making the compliment meaningful and impactful. So you can't lie so, to people. So I have to mean it? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Okay. So can you come up with an honest compliment? It comes from the heart. Yeah. You're such a nice and caring person. Uh, I said be genuine. <laughs> That was a joke from your side. Oh, yes. Okay. Thank you. I have put a lot of work into my <laughs> personality. I've always been like this. You should be more like me, but I don't need to tell you that. Can you leave the room for a minute? <laughs> Excuse me. I'm just going to go to the bathroom. <laughs> you are nice. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> Number two. Be... <laughs> At the bathroom. No. <laughs> you are nice. No, let's make it number two. At the mirror. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> number two. Be specific. Instead of a generic compliment, focus on a particular trait, action, or accomplishment that you genuinely admire about the person. This shows that you have paid attention and are sincere in your praise. Okay. Be specific. You're such a nice and generous person. Should I say why or what? Uh, yeah, specifically. What um, is it that you are complimenting? Okay. Specifically. Specific. <laughs> okay, now you get it. <laughs> yeah, now I get it. Why didn't you say that oh, from the beginning? Sorry. No. I mispronounced it. <laughs> You're such a caring person because you really like to take care of me and take care of people. Well, me. <laughs> like, I am people. <laughs> yeah. I am the people. I can say a specific instance. Mm -hmm. uh, Midsummer. That really shows what a caring person you are. That you took care of me while I was in such a bad shape. And being rude to you and all that and still you really took care of me and i am really thankful for that and uh, yeah i do mean that thank you <laughs> <Sorry>. <laughs> i've put a lot of work into this okay <laughs> i'm so sorry that's the only thing i can come up with I do care about you a lot. I know. Thank you for that. You're welcome. And I do care about you, too. Yeah, I know. Okay, number four. Did we take three? Number three. Use positive language. Choose positive words and phrases to convey your compliment. Be uplifting and avoid any backhanded compliments or mixed messages that may confuse the person. Okay. Don't swear at me, please. No backhands. No backhands, only front hands. High five. <laughs> Perfect. Oh. Oh, ow. Okay. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I missed your face. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, was the way I said the last time was that good enough for, for That was that was pretty good. <laughs>
Number four, be timely. Deliver your compliment at an appropriate time and place. Consider the context. Context. <laughs> Contacts. Consider your contacts. <laughs> Put them in if necessary. Yeah, so you can see the person. <laughs> Make sure you look at them. Wait, it's not Hold you. Hold on. I'm talking oh, to another person. Wrong person. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Sorry, stranger. Consider the context and find a moment when the person is receptive and available to receive your kind words. Yeah, so not like... <laughs> If I'm having a very important conversation <laughs> yeah. with someone else, you can't just come up to me and be like, you're nice. <laughs> you have a, a serious conversation with your boss and I'm yeah. like, uh, excuse me, <laughs> you're, <nice. laughs> you're so caring. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Matthias. <laughs> Can this wait? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> Say to you, Bond. Shut up. Shut up. This is more important than whatever you have to say. <laughs> I don't hear you giving me compliments. <laughs> like, I was trying to fire you. <laughs> I need a compliment right now. <laughs> yeah. You're not helping. <laughs> okay, number five. Be confident and sincere. Deliver your compliment with confidence and sincerity. That's exactly what I just said. <laughs> yeah. Maintain eye contact. Use a warm tone of voice and smile. Your body language and tone can enhance the impact of your words and show your genuine appreciation. I'm going to say that one more time. And Are you also listening? be sincere. <laughs> and be sincere. Okay, listen to this last sentence very closely. Okay. Okay? Your body language and tone can enhance the impact of your words and show your genuine appreciation. Okay? <laughs> Okay. Body language. Uh, yeah. Do you know what that is? That's the farting. <laughs> that no. no? No, okay. What? <laughs> no. Uh, yeah, I know what it is. Okay. Yeah. Okay. It's me dancing, isn't it? Yeah. It's your dancing. <laughs> Dance while giving me compliments. That's what you're supposed to do. Yes. <laughs> Can you sing, too? Yeah. Can you sing and dance? Can you make it like a, a flash mob? <laughs> yeah, a musical. Yeah, I want a musical. <laughs> That's what I want. If you want to compliment me, make sure you do it musical style. Yeah. That would be great. Mm -hmm. You're such a nice and caring person. I don't have a melody. Do you have another compliment? You are effing strong. <laughs> Okay, okay. Remember, giving compliments is a wonderful way to brighten someone's day. So don't hesitate to share genuine words of praise when you notice something admirable about someone. So, if you see someone, then you should probably compliment them. If I just see someone. <laughs> if you see a person, just compliment them. I mean, a lot of the times, if I see someone and I like their shirt, I'll tell them, hey, I like your shirt. Yeah, I usually don't. Mm, well, I, I think, have this sudden urge to tell people. I think that's a Swedish thing. Mm, probably. We, yeah, we don't really give people compliments that much. We should change that. Yeah. So if you're listening to this, make sure to make it your goal for today to give someone a compliment and brighten someone else's day. Mm. And they will probably appreciate it. And then uh, they'll be like, why are you giving me a compliment? And then you can tell them about Roasty Toasty Ghosty. Yeah. The best podcast ever. Yeah. Do that. Do that. Make it your goal. Compliment someone. That's all I had to say for today. Yeah. That's all for today. Anything else? No. No. I don't think We so. are definitely done here. I think so. This is good. It feels good. Yeah. I'm content. Yes. You're content? Yeah. Yeah. You yeah. are content. I'm content. <laughs> Yeah. That is what you are. I mean, yeah. It's In a not, way, I guess. Yeah, it is not wrong. I want to give you a compliment, too. Okay, yeah. Yes, please. <clears throat> Do I have to answer? Yes, yeah. genuinely. Yes. <laughs> yes. No, I'm going to be genuine yeah. and sincere and use positive language and use body language and everything else. <laughs> be sincere. Be sincere and genuine. Yeah. And positive. <laughs> 
and um, smile. Yeah, and um, body language. <laughs> and body language. Yeah, don't forget to dance. <laughs> okay. Or fart if you're... Uh... <laughs> no, I'd, I'd rather not. Okay. <laughs> Maybe not. Let's not, though. <laughs> you're so... <laughs> Stop. Weirdo. Okay. Okay, let's see. You are so clever with words sometimes. I will just say something and you will, how would you say it? Give my words a creative turn. You know what I mean? Yeah. Do you have an example? I'm sorry, but I know what you're, what you mean, but mm. I... But it catches me by surprise. Yeah. Usually. And... It's often in a, like, comedic way, or... Usually it is. Yeah. yeah. That's usually what you're going for, and I love it. I think it's funny and creative, and yeah, it catches me off guard, and I like it. Thank you for saying that, and um, I, I love creativity and i try to be as creative as i can be and i think you're also a creative person and it's fun to have our kind of back and forth Mm -hmm. if i come up with something then maybe you can have another thing i can add to it yeah yeah back at me and we're back and forth it's like a game of tennis yeah With words. <laughs> yeah. I love, uh, speaking of uh, the tennis, when we mishear each other. Yeah. And then we mishear the mishearing. And yeah. mishear the mishearing's mishearing. <laughs> yeah. And just... <laughs> we keep going back yeah. and forth like that. I think yeah. that's the funniest. Yeah. One word can end up, like... Completely different. Yeah. Minutes after, it, we don't even remember what the first word was. Yeah, we don't even know what we were talking no, about. No, that, that that's funny. And um, we do have bad hearing. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh, and we're creative and uh, can come up with our own words instead. Yeah, we kind of find humor in everything. Yeah. And it's like when we watch the Chinese movies mm-hmm. and we hear uh, things they say in Chinese in English instead. And yeah. we just say what it sounds like in English. Yeah. It, that's also funny. Nay. 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 Ha 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 ha. Yeah. It really sounds like they're reading off a script when yeah. they're laughing. Yeah. Ha 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 ha. That's five haws. <laughs> Too many haws. One less haw, please. <laughs> Try again. <laughs> I'm so glad you're my best friend. Yeah, likewise. Thank you. Would you like to wrap this up? Yes. As much as I love sitting here talking to you, I want to stop talking to you. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Thank you for listening. Thank you. And we will, I was going to say, talk to you next week. Yeah, we'll be back next week. We'll be back next week. Can yeah. you do Schwarzenegger? No. Really. Oh, come on. Just a little bit. We'll be back. We'll be back. Ugh, whatever. We'll be back next week. Hey, hey, we'll be back. <laughs> That's Schwarzenegger. <laughs> hey, we'll be back. <laughs> yep. Thank you. Goodbye. Nailed it. Bye. <laughs> Goodbye. Thank you for listening to the Roasty Toasty Ghosty Podcast. When you're done here, please follow or subscribe to this podcast and give us an honest review slash rating. Then go to our Instagram at Roasty Toasty Ghosty Pod and follow us there. While you're on our Instagram, go ahead and find the corresponding post to this episode, and we encourage you to continue a conversation started within the episode there. Our podcast is based on organic marketing, so please help us grow by sharing to all of the platforms. Even if you don't like it, I'm sure all of your friends would like to know. We'll be back next Tuesday. Goodbye. Bye, Lauren. Goodbye, Matthias.